Late East Enders actor Bill Tretcher has left an estate of more than 500,000 pounds to his wife and family. The actor, who played Arthur Fowler as one of the soap's original cast member, died last year at the age of 92. He starred in the BBC soap from 1985 until 1996 before moving to Suffolk with his wife. Australian actress Catherine Kessie and his two children. Figures released by the probate office show he left an estate of £504,676.10 after his death from COVID and pneumonia in November 2022. In 2015, he revealed he was suffering from ataxia, a disorder that can affect coordination, balance, and speech. Sadly, the disease effectively put an end to his acting career for good as the star lost his ability to walk. First, Bill was seen needing a walking stick, then a frame before he was forced to use a wheelchair to get around. In his will, he left his estate on trust for his widow and children Jamie and Sophie. He also named his grandchildren as some of the discretionary beneficiaries who could inherit from his estate at the discretion of his wife and children. During his time in Albert Square, the star received critical acclaim for his portrayal of Arthur who was imprisoned for a crime he didn't commit. A London boy, Bill was born in Hackney in 1940 before he was evacuated to Gloucestershire during the Second World War. After national service with the Royal Air Force, he managed to save up enough money to send himself to drama school after working for P&O. Bill went on to star in successful West End productions before he moved into television. He starred the Sweeney with Denny's Waterman, Dad's Army, The Bill, and Casualty and also appeared in films including Tale of the Mummy. Elsewhere in the soap, this week a legendary character made a surprise return in flashback scenes from 2014. During Tuesday night's episode, Ricky Norwood reprised his role as the much-loved Fat Boy Chubb after getting murdered eight years ago. Fat Boy died in grisly circumstances in the Christmas 2015 storyline, with the character getting killed in a car in a case of mistaken identity. He died off-screen after Ronnie Mitchell arranged for her enemy Vincent Hubbard to be sent to the car crusher, but Fat Boy was accidentally trapped in the car boot and killed instead. In the latest East Enders episode, Cindy Beale came face to face with her ex George Knight. Cindy finally told George the truth and viewers were treated to flashback scenes set in Marbella in Spain in 2014. The flashback showed her leaving him and her daughters after learning Lucy. Her daughter had died. During a secret visit back to the square, Cindy was seen watching Ian from afar as he grieved the horrific loss. Cindy was then approached by DCI Mary Nichols, her witness protection handler, who forced her O get in her car. While chatting in the car, they were briefly interrupted by Arthur Fatboy Chubb. 